Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is actually a wig review by So Good Hair or from So Good Hair rather. Um, SoGoodHair.com. I'm going to be coming to you guys, talking to you guys a little bit about this unit that they sent me. It is the unit that you see on my head right here. So yeah, um, if you're interested in seeing where I got this hair, what I like, what I don't, all that good stuff, just keep on watching. Okay, you guys, so this unit, as I stated, is from SoGoodHair.com. They reached out to me and asked me if they could send me a unit, and I agreed. They sent me this unit right here. This is their uh, Virgin Brazilian Curly Lace Front Wig. It's in a natural color, and I got mine in um, a 12-inch. So this is what it looks like right here, you guys. I'm going to go ahead and make this video short and sweet. Um, things that I like about it, things that I don't. So I really, really, really am enjoying this wig, you guys. Like I said, it is a lace front. It is not a full lace wig. So you do get lace from about here to here and about here, about this far back on the wig. So you get a pretty good amount of parting space. However, it doesn't go as far on the sides as it does um, at the top. So be aware of that. But this wig, again, you guys, I guess this is a big thing. The biggest thing that I want you guys to keep in mind as I talk about this wig is that it's only like $88, $90. Um, and this is an amazing quality wig for the price that you're paying for it. So although you don't get straight back um, parting space all over, you get a really, really nice amount of parting space. You also get a little bit of lace in the back. So if you decide that you want to pull your hair up in a ponytail, you have that option as well, which I think is really, really nice. I don't think I'm going to be pulling this up since it's so short, but the fact that I have that option is always a good thing. So um, as far as the lace on this wig as well, I do think that it's like a medium brown color. Um, I did bleach the knots on my wig, which kind of altered the color of the lace just a little bit. But I used a purple shampoo to get the brightness out. Um, and although it um, altered the color of the lace a little bit, it wasn't too much. It was still kind of like that medium brown color. So if you're my skin complexion, um, I mean, it'll, it won't look too bad, but it's not going to be a perfect, perfect match for you. I guess maybe not medium brown, maybe more like a lighter brown color. Um, but it, it'll be fine. You can put a little makeup on the hairline, on the lace, and you'll be good to go. It's not that big of a deal. It looks nice. It really does. So, yeah. Um, the wig did come pre-plucked. However, I definitely went back in and plucked some more because, you know, companies will do their best to pluck hairlines. They don't want to go too overboard because, you know, you... Hairlines are definitely subjective to who who is getting them, who's receiving them. You don't know how people are liking their wigs, what they like the hairlines to look like. So they actually did a good job with plucking the hairline, but I went ahead in and plucked it a little bit more. Um, yeah, so the hairline looks really, really good. I don't know if you guys can see it from where you are. As far as tangling and shedding, I do get some shedding, but not too crazy. And I think that the shedding that I am getting is because, again, I did bleach the knots on my lace. And we all know that once you bleach the knots, shedding is kind of like an aftermath type of side effect. So I think that might be what that's from. Um, tangling, nope, which is a dream. And I think the reason why this hair doesn't tangle is because it's so freaking soft. Something about this wig that I really like, you guys, is that even though it's curly hair, it's kind of like a relaxed curly hair. Like, I could brush through this hair and the curls would just kind of not drop completely, but they would kind of like relax a little bit, you know? So, um, I feel like that is going to be really, really nice for if I ever want to straighten this hair. I think it'll go bone straight because the curls are so buttery and like um, not a super tight, like, structured, firm curl. So, yeah, this wig is 150% density. I think that that's a nice density for the style of this wig and the length of this wig. I know some people like to go a little bit up. Um, so keep that in mind if you're going to decide to purchase this wig. It is only 150% density. But overall, I think it's a really, really beautiful wig. I would say cop it if you like this type of style. Um, if you like... This could be like a nice work wig for somebody, like if you work a 9 to 5 or whatever and you want something like cute but still appropriate for work. This is a really, really nice wig um, and I can do you a little bit better. If you use the code RH10, you will get 10% off of your order. Is it 10% off or $10 off? Let me see. If you use the code RH10, you'll get $10 off of your order. I don't know about you, but I love a discount. Sounds great to me. Um, and this wig is already only like 90 bucks. I think 80 bucks, 90 bucks. So I mean, $10 off is a steal. Why not? 
Um, I don't get any money, you guys, from you using the discount code. I know some people feel a little bit weird about that. I do not get paid at all from you guys using the discount code. It's just a way for you guys to get a little something off and help you guys with you all's purchase, okay? So yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. I am so grateful that you all keep coming back to watch my videos. I really, really appreciate it. If you have any questions about this video or any other videos or anything like that, make sure that you leave them down below in the comment section. Before I leave you guys, I want to let you know that I'm so appreciative of everybody who has been watching me thus far. I'm sure if you've been watching me from the beginning, you know that I've been just kind of trying to figure out what I want this channel to be and what kind of content I want to put out. And um, I definitely feel like I'm starting to understand like what I want to do here on YouTube. And um, you guys are going to see a really big shift in content coming up very soon on this channel. Um, it's going to be a little bit different. So I hope you guys like it. I hope you guys continue to support me even throughout the change. I'm going to be doing a lot more like lifestyle type videos, a lot more of like uh, DIY and helpful how-to videos, something that can help you guys when you're watching me entertain you but still like teach you something and something that's a little bit different from just makeup and I do really enjoy the try-on haul so you guys will see more of those um, but we're going to be throwing a lot more in there too so I hope you guys are um, excited for that. I know that I am. Again, thank you guys so much for continuing to come back and continue to support me and continue to watch my content. I can't wait to see you guys in the next video. And yeah, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.